visit the Columbus Zoo and Aquarium for zoo lights this year, you might want to stop by and pay a visit to our closest relatives. Humans are classified as members of the great ape family, and we share nearly 99% of the same DNA with bonobos. And as I found out, the bonobos at the Columbus Zoo share something else with humans, a fascination for computers. So the computer gives them a chance to have that extra mental activity that they really, really thrive on. They are um, playful, they, they are curious, the they are affectionate, and curator Audra Meinold says super intelligent. Because um, they're always smarter than we are every day that we're working with them. <laughs> Um, I think you can just see the intelligence in the animals, you know, they understand how to figure things out. They actively try to problem solve through any challenges we give them during their day. The challenge they like best, computer games. They start with the most basic program, push a dot, get a treat, then two dots. This is Birdie who loves the dot game, but she still struggles with the concept of tic-tac-toe that Amelia is mastering. Amelia knows she has to keep playing until she gets three in a row. They do seem to understand that when they hit them enough that something happens. And just like your kids, there's a bit of a scuffle when Birdie tries to steal the treat that Amelia earned. Melon, maybe, maybe it's melon. Some of the adult bonobos who were focused on lunch when we were there are already able to put colored dots into a specific sequence to earn a treat. Animals in their native habitats have to work very hard every day for their food and their natural resources. So we try to emulate that here at all times at the zoo because it's important for them to stay physically active and mentally active. They are thriving here and the Columbus Zoo is an important part of conservation and protection for this endangered species that's native only to the Democratic Republic of Congo. They are the least known species of great apes. Um, they haven't had that champion that uh, you know chimpanzees have had with Jane Goodall or gorillas with Diane Fossey. But they have champions here who are looking always for new and better ways to keep these smart apes stimulated and happy. We do have the ability to load things in, so we could allow them to, say, choose the enrichment device that they want to play with for the day um, or what food items they even want to have right now. So we would like to be able to use it to help provide more choice and control for the animals so that they get to have an active decision making process in their day to day. Now, the Columbus Zoo Bonobos will get some attention when the Broadway play Come From Away comes to the Ohio Theater in the new year. It's the story of 38 planes forced to land in Gander, Newfoundland on 9-11.